Alrighty folks, so a very, very successful week for me in the gym. You guys are about to see my shoulder workout from today. I actually hit overhead press today and I was going to go for 140 pounds for five reps. And um, yeah, I kind of just, I was originally gonna drive to my other gym and just try to do 145 pounds for three reps today. And I'm glad I scrapped that because that would have been a terrible idea. I did end up getting 145, 140 pounds I should say, sorry, 140 pounds, but I got it for four reps and I push pressed the last rep to make it the fifth rep. Now, um, I'm not gonna consider that a new five rep max. I, I, ide ideally, everybody, it's, it's great to be progressing every single week and I, Got 135 pounds for five reps last week, and I'm not honestly gonna get super down about uh, not hitting the fifth rep today because I felt great going into it. I will say that uh, on my uh, my top set before I went for the 140 for five, I did 125 pounds for three reps. Now that's at like an RPE of about seven and a half. So putting that into consideration, or I should say, uh, taking that into consideration, uh, it's pretty realistic that I'm not or I wasn't gonna hit. 140 for five, but you guys will see here in a, in a few moments that the the, the sets were as, as good as they could be. Now, uh, my second and third sets of um, the overhead press at 140 pounds were, I'd say I got the second set for about three clean reps and then push press the last two reps. And then on my third set, I got, I got it up for, I'd say about a rep and a half and then push press the last a few reps to make it five but uh guys the overhead press is a very 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 taxing movement on the body so i am uh, i'm just happy to be able to to get in and be able to train at those three major top sets now like i've mentioned numerous times before i would always go into the gym and i would uh, really just I would I ramp up to a, a high weight. For example, my previous uh, workouts would look like maybe 115 pounds for uh, for five reps, and then 125 pounds for three reps, and then a max top set at 140 pounds for three reps, maybe five reps, and then ramp it back down to 115 for five, and then 95 for eight reps, just something like that. But I'm maintaining that workload up at 140 pounds. So that's something that I'm not really used to doing, and it's getting me so much more, I guess, benefit out of my workouts, and I'm finding my intensity is just super high. Um, and uh, it's not something I've, I've, I've never really trained like this before, and I've, I'm doing that with all of my compound lifts. I'm doing that with my deadlifts, I'm doing that with my bench press, I'm doing that with my squat, I'm doing that with everything. So I'm happy about that. And um, you know, I will say that the, the I didn't hit the five reps completely like I'd want to hit them, but I've really made tremendous amount of progress this week. I hit 295 pounds on my squat yesterday. I hit 385 pounds on my deadlift, and uh, things are really going in the right direction. And uh, I, I really can't, I can't get mad about that. So I am, uh, I, I, I should say more in regards to the shoulder workout. Um, I finished off with some incline pressing and I did some tricep work and everything. I threw up some tricep accessory work for you guys to kind of check out because I have, you know, and, oh, and shoulder accessory work too. I like to do a kind of, it's like a standing Arnold press. It's really good unilateral movement for building up shoulder strength and just upper body strength in general. I would say that I am, uh, I'm really a big fan of overhead pressing because it's, a, it's one of my, I guess, stronger lifts for uh, my body weight whatever that may be, but a lot of people like to stray away from the overhead press just because it's, it's a hard, it's a really, really, really hard lift to do. And uh, I feel like uh, when you really, you focus on the things that you're not going to like a lot, especially with overhead pressing in the gym, it's it's going to be more beneficial in that area. So I thought I'd show you guys and kind of take you through it, a shoulder slash push day. I'm having two push power days each week for me, and I'm finding that with that and combined with the calorie surplus is really making my pressing strength go straight up. And uh, it's kind of funny because I've never, ever, ever, I've never benched, well, I don't know why I'm saying never, ever, because I've, my maximum bench I've ever gotten to is 235 pounds and um, I'm working my way back to two plates again and that's a really big, that's a milestone for me. And, uh, but it's just, it's taken years, it's taken three years for me to get back to being able to press this much weight before and so I'm really happy about that. And um, I really wanted to, I wanted to make it a, a long-term goal to also be able to, to overhead press a plate and a half. So that'd be 185 pounds for a solid, a solid rep and to obviously get back to a two plate bench. So those are some goals that I want to set for myself. And um, you know what guys, it's, I talked about this in a few videos, but really it, if you have issues with gaining body weight and you have issues with gaining body fat, it's just best to to really just be realistic because I have so many people and I see it every single day people go You know what? I really want to I want to gain muscle and I want to lose fat I'm like, 
be realistic here. <laughs> uh, you need to just be okay with, with gaining body fat. You need to be okay with, with doing that because that's gonna happen in a calorie surplus. That's gonna happen when you gain strength. And um, you need to focus on, on the benefits to gaining strength and in, in, in the fact that, I mean, with strength comes body fat. It's just natural. Um, losing body fat on the flip side is not hard at all. All it really takes is a deficit of calories and eating less and moving more. So uh, that's pretty much all I have to say about that. And everybody, I hope you guys have enjoyed another kind of workout video slash me kind of share, showing, ah, sharing my thoughts. All this is unedited, so gotta love my, my stumbles and my, st my stutters. Um, if you guys want to see more, I guess, videos like this, let me know down in the comments below. And hope you guys are having a good one. See you guys later.